guys so the last video you just saw was us test fitting on the new product that custom tuning came out with and that is a black nose grill that you could put on the, the front of an XSE and this one is a part that is like the TRD cover that's on Blackhawk Japan but this one's only one sixth the price of it and the one on Blackhawk it costs around 600 which is 300 plus 300 shipping it's kind of weird it's like the same price but this one is in the US already and this is around a hundred dollars so uh, we're gonna test fit this on just for you guys to see and it's really really easy all you need to do is just get some double-sided tape and scissors and and put it around the edges and then you're just gonna slap it on right here and this is pretty much a perfect fit and you can see like that it's already fitting snug you don't even need to like hold on to it so what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be putting some double-sided tape on and putting it on and before this came out a lot of people were wrapping the the front and that costed around hundred fifty to two hundred dollars depending on who wrapped it and it usually was a two-piece and there would be a line that goes around here so some of them were not as clean as others and this one is a complete one piece and it's in gloss black so you don't need to do anything to it so and it's made out of a really durable plastic and it's a nice glass black. So this part is perfect for people who wanna have that look like Lexus or, or just have that nice uh, clean look in the front. And the good thing about this part is that you could change it to whatever color you want by wrapping it. And it's already glass black, so if you wanna have it like as a silver or a Roaring Thunder, or even carbon fiber wrap, you could put that on. And it's way easier than putting it on this because there's a bunch of curves here that you can't really access this one you could just slap it on so we're gonna be installing this right now so the first thing that you're gonna do is clean the front of the, the car from any bugs or anything get all that residue out so the double-sided tape has something to bond to so what we're gonna be using is 3m VHB tape and this is what we use for a bunch of stuff on the car and you can see right there it our car ceramic coated that's how you know you it's ceramic coated and then uh, we're just going to be putting this along the uh, edges of the uh, cover and we'll be good we're just going to take off the red stuff and then slap it on so you could do two things with this you could cake it with a bunch of double-sided tape if you want it to be permanent or you could just put a little bit on the sides and kind of be lenient with the tape so that if you want to take it off later on then it's going to be easier and you won't crack it or anything so what we're going to do is the the second part we're going to be putting in a lenient amount of tape so just in case if you want to do anything else to the front bumper or anything we could just take it off with no problem so as you can see here we got the double-sided tape put in and we noticed that as we were test fitting it back onto the car it was actually a lot tighter so it's going to be a one one off kind of thing that once you take it off and try to put it on you got to do it right the first time or else if you try to take it off and on and off then i don't know what's going to happen it's probably going to ruin the adhesive so let's do this right the first time and let's do it so we took off the red stuff and now we're going to be putting it on Okay, so we put it on and I'm just going to do a little wipe down. There's a little bit of uh, fingerprints, so I'm just spraying it on with some wax. It looks extra shiny. And this will also uh, keep the paint intact 
and it's actually like a guard like a screen protector for your paint and when you take it off then your paint is pretty much brand new in the bottom if you still have a brand new car so it looks really really good I honestly like this look better than the white and it adds like a nice like dark finish on the front and then the rest of the car is white Okay, so we're done with the install and I really, really like how it went and I really like that black slick finish and it actually makes it look way more cleaner. And now, if you know what this is, then this is what's gonna be going on this car. And uh, this opportunity was presented to us when one of our friends decided to go on a different route with their car and he technically built this whole setup from the ground up and we actually added more things onto it so that it'll be better. So what he first got was air demand suspension, which actually a lot of Teslas use. We got an Airlift uh, 3P management system, which is one of the, the best systems and the most common system out there. And we got, um, we first got one compressor, which is a 444C uh, Viarm compressor. And we actually bought extra two more, so we probably are gonna sell one of them off and so that we can have two compressors in the back and a polished four uh, gallon tank. So we also ordered some more parts that are still coming. We got some check valves coming in and water traps for the, the actual tank. And we also got some Megan Racing camber arms since our uh, wheel setup is really aggressive in the back. So we're gonna try to camber it in and that's about it. And stay tuned for more videos and we're going to be putting this on probably next week since we're still getting a little bit more parts. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you in the next video.